morning, even though it's the afternoon. And today, as you can tell, we're off to go and watch Chelsea again. They're playing Arsenal, Capital One Cup semi-final first leg. And yeah, this is the third video of 2018. Let's go. Pretty good. Still can't believe correct do a coffee for a quid. Can't complain too much. Catch up with you in Fulham. Made it to Elves Court and now we're just waiting for Dad to finish work and food and then watch Chelsea. Hopefully win, but you know, it's Chelsea. They'll probably they'll probably end up losing because that's what they end up doing a lot. Right then, so we've just finished eating. So now the plan is we're going to try and get to the bridge just in time for kickoff. Uh, we've been quite poor this season with making it in time for kickoff. So hopefully we can catch kickoff this time. We're going to have a look at the teams, and Chelsea have gone with quite a strong team. So hopefully they actually play a bit better than they did against Norwich and actually score some goals. And yeah, I'll see you at the bridge. Chelsea drew nil-nil with, with Arsenal, so they've now played three games this year, and they've all ended in draws. Yeah, it could have been worse. Uh, Chelsea kind of dominated most of the game and probably deserved to win on balance, but I think they just didn't really have much of a cutting edge, and even though they had lots of the ball, uh, they had lots of possession, they had lots of kind of chances, uh, they never really kind of pulled it out and sorted out what they wanted to do. And they just kind of lacked width. 
and whenever the ball got up to kind of the front two of Hazard and Morata, it just kind of slowed down and they had no kind of incision through the middle. So, I don't know. I think they either need to go back to playing how they'd played last season when they won the league with wingers uh, either side of the striker or they need to change the tactics and come up with a way of getting width from the wing backs without leaving themselves open to the counter attack too much. I think they were just scared of losing. But they didn't lose. They played reasonably well. Arguably they should have had two or three goals. It's not the end of the world. It's not perfect either, but it is what it is. So anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. Remember, please like, comment and subscribe. You're all awesome. Roll credits.